hello guys welcome once again in this video i'm going to show you how to use chart control with your visual basic windows form application so let's get started i have this blank project made and in here i will take a button to load a chart and i will take a chart control obviously to load my charts so i will search for the chart and you will find this chart control in this data tab so just drag and drop this chart control and resize it according to your requirements and I will change the name or text of this button as load chart and before writing any code for our application I want to show some of the properties of these charts and how you can customize these charts so the first property I want to show you is the series so just select your chart and go to the property called series here which is this so just click this button near series collection and in here you can customize your series so first of all by default your series name is uh, series 1 so I change it as something else for example I want to show name versus age series so I to name my series as age and I can customize my chart by changing the background image if you want you can just choose any image into your uh, into your uh, background as your background image of your series and you can also change the border color for example red you can also change the foreground color for example I'm going to choose this green color and immediately when you choose it you will be able to see this effect here green color and the broader are red right and you have the most important property called chart type so this defines what kind of chart you want to make it's not restricted to the bar chart you can make a different type of chart using this chart control so just click this chart control and just click this button here and you can choose here pie chart point chart and other line chart and whatever you want to use so for this video I'm going to stick to the column chart which is most basic and I will click OK and you can also change the property of this chart also for example you want to change the background color of this chart so go to the property of back color by default it's white you can choose any color for example this dark gray and you can see its property is changed now some code so double click this button and in here write first of all just see the name of your chart which is chart 1 right so just remember this and here write me dot chart 1 which is the name of your chart dot series and in here we will pass in the name of the series which is age right so just write here age this is the name of the series and then write dot points dot add x y and in here we will pass two argument one is the x axis and other is the y axis first argument it will take is the x axis value so first argument is the name as x axis so i will write the name versus his age so for example 33 and i will press enter and in this is the first bar of your bar data of your chart right so for example i want to show multiple bars i will just copy and paste it four times for example and i will change the name john and age is 50 and the age is 20 
and the age is for example 40 and now when I run the program and when I click this button it will load the chart which is name versus age so our first age was for the mark is 33 you can see yeah it's 33 for John it's 50 so it's for John the age is 50 in this way it will show the chart now for example you want to show multiple bars with the same x-axis so for example I want to show the marks age plus I want to show the score or marks scored by mark in some examination so how, how can I show multiple bars with the same name so let's see how can we use add it just select your chart once again and go to the property series once again here and in here we just need to add one more series so I will just click this add button and I will change the name of the series as marks this time and this time I'm going to leave all these uh, things all these properties as default so basically you know uh, or, or you need to play with these properties in order to customize your chart right so I will click OK and I will just click this button once again and I will copy this code and paste it below and this series name is marks right so I will write marks here and the age of marks for example he is 70 year old guy or maybe he is 40 year old no his score we are giving the score right so he scored 90 out of 100 marks right and for the other other persons we just copy and paste the data and copy and paste right and these are the marks so second series will be mark marks and the age or the scores right so second person scores 70 third scores 40 and fourth scores 66 for example and now I will run the program and when I click this load chart button it shows me the name versus age chart plus it shows me the name versus marks chart and it shows the name of the series here also age and marks right so in, in this way you can make different kind of chart with the help of this Microsoft chart control I hope you have enjoyed this video. Please rate, comment and subscribe and bye.